Welcome back to Let's Play Gran Turismo 4 Part 32. So, uh, in this episode, we're gonna do, I'm gonna butcher the fuck out of saying this, but we're gonna do the Tous France Championnat. I completely fucked that up, but it's a five race championship. And I was gonna use a Renault 5 for this, but I kinda can use it in a different series. It's pretty soon to be, like, Anyways, but whatever. There's actually a different car I'm going to be driving, and it's going to need some upgrades, because it's kind of slow, and I don't see any other point that I'll be able to use this thing. So that's pretty much why. Using the Alpine, whatever the fuck this is, I don't even know. And like I said, we'll need some upgrades. So I believe it's naturally aspirated. Fuck. That's nowhere near enough. That's better, but still bad. I'm a stage two, at least. This is probably a terrible idea. Probably just wasting all my time doing this. Sports tires will be fine. It's already light enough. Considering it's rear engine, I'm... that's not what I wanted to buy, but... I guess I'll take it anyways, whatever. Fuck. That's what I wanted. Like I said, I don't know why I'm doing this. I could have just gone with the Renault 5 and just said tiny upgrades to it and be just fine, but I'm stupid like this, that's why I'm doing this. Get the NOS on it as well, and I think I'll put a racing muffler on it, and that should be good yeah fuck it and just for safe measure I'm also gonna throw sports suspension on it just to add a little bit of camber all right uh shenanigans out of the way wait this thing has a one make race well, shit, thank God I didn't do uh, weight reduction on it, because I can't revert it. So, uh, let's see if I'm overpowered or still underpowered. Five race championship, 10,000 credits each. So, here the fuck we go. Well, fuck. I uh, kind of managed to secure an eight and a half second pole. Yeah. So, gonna have to nerf this thing a little bit. Just, I guess I'll just take those two off for this race. Stage 2 turbo will be just fine. Taking off the turbo would be taking off too much. So, here we go with four laps around Opera Paris. Ah, uh, damn it. Only 36 A spec points. Well, rip. Also starting way in front of everyone else. The Pojo overtook the Renault before the race even started. Which I hope I actually get that uh, Pojo 205. Because I really like that car as well. I would have used it for this race if I could buy it, but eh. Using the Renault 5 for the Euro Hot Hatch League. Anyways, yeah, this thing is a little bit loose, but it's not too bad. Also, this is another car that's missing a right side mirror, so that's funny, I guess. There's a lot of cars without right side mirrors in this game. I don't know if that was a thing back in the back in the olden days or what. Honestly, I could, well. Probably not for other tracks, but for this one at least, I could have taken off the turbo and kept on the exhaust and the chip. It'd be just fine. Also, that's a wall. What the fuck am I doing? Yeah, I'm kind of glad I chose this car instead of the Renault, because I could use the Renault later on. This I kind of can't. Well, maybe I can. I don't fucking know, but yeah.
kind of still suck ass at driving in this camera view, but I'm going to be using it a lot in the endurance races. Probably. Okay. That's where I... That's where I lose it. I don't know why I keep looking back like this, even though there's nothing back there. Yeah. Yeah. Cheeseburgers. Yeah. Hot dogs. Yeah. Donuts. Yeah. Bar fighting. Yeah. That was a terrible meme, but fuck it. Bonk. Every time I drive in this camera view, I'm gonna drive like shit, so get used to it. But I'm trying to change it up, looking at the front of the car again for some reason. And again. Yep, turned in too early. <laughs> for the second time in a row. Oh yeah, I forgot. Fucking downshift, damn it. Yeah, I really need to get used to this view because I suck dick, as I mentioned countless times. Pojo has almost caught back up to me because of it. I'm getting loose again. Shit. I don't know why I torture myself by using rear engine cars. Or even mid engine. They all behave the exact same. Learned that from the roof, the MR2, and now this thing. So yeah, I pretty much got nothing else to say now. Five race championship. It's going to be somewhat lengthy, probably around like 40 to 50 minutes, I'm guessing. And I'm getting really loose right there. I'll just, instead of trying to correct myself and losing it, I'll just bonk the wall. Approaching the final lap. I think I've actually been to this place before. Like, in France. I forgot what it's called. It's like some kind of palace thing. But yeah. Uh, also, all these identical buildings. I just noticed that. Even here. The fuck? What is this, China? Even across the street, they're identical. Is every building on this track identical? Even here. Is this France or Communist China? Holy shit. Oh, also, uh, losing control of the car because I'm paying too much attention elsewhere. Yeah, I've been to Paris in real life. I've been to the Colosseum, random places around Europe. I love the European countryside and Switzerland and Austria, but as far as the cities like London, Paris, Rome itself, they were kind of shitty. And also their food sucked ass. The only time I was ever full on that two-week trip was in the UK. 
the UK and Switzerland. That was the only times I was full. The rest of the times I was starving because I couldn't find anything decent to eat. So, there's that. America's superior on food. No debate. And there we go across the line. Finally. Actually, I think this place is next to the river, but I don't see the Eiffel Tower anywhere. I figured they would have added that detail into the map, but who gives a shit? I don't care anymore. So, 10,000, I think it is. Dead on right once again. Boop. Race number two. All right, here we are at Sarth. I'm going to have to tune the transmission for this because the gears are quite short. And here we go with one lap around Lasarth with chicanes. And I didn't take the turbo off because if I would have put the exhaust and the chip on, I would have been severely underpowered, so... Kind of should have just went with stage one turbo, but I didn't want to have to keep redoing the series over and over again, so fuck it. Anyways, yeah, going back to the tryhard cam for the rest of the series because I feel like it. So, here we go. Little person uh, straight off the bat. This is the Pojo I was talking about, the previous race. Kind of like it. And I'd like to use it for the Euro Hot Hound really Early, yes, whatever. But the problem is I already have a Renault 5 Turbo, and that's what I'm going to be using. Also, these two, these three are all losing it. My god. Rip Renault. Okay, I'm going to be next. Why do I always talk shit? Well deserved. Eh, getting a little loose. Keep it straight. I'm going to see without... Or see how well this is without Nos. Also, this is a Renault Clio. Interesting. I should have checked if there were any in the used dealership. Because I've seen a few pop up before. Seems like I tuned the transmission a little bit long, but... Oh well, at least I'm not hitting top speed. Or I might, if there weren't any chicanes. And I think I'm... Okay, kept it relatively straight, except this guy didn't. GG's, Pojo. Goodbye. I'm hugging the wall. Seems like one guy fell back pretty far, and the Renault is reclaimed uh, for second, third, fourth, fifth. I actually had to count that out. I'm so fucking garbage. Yeah, pretty car. No point in even going into sixth gear. I didn't even top out fifth. Okay, getting loose. I'm going to try not to use the NOS the rest of this race. Considering it looks like I don't even need it. Unless I screw up. I'll go ahead and let the Pojo pass me. So I can just do this. Seems like that group can't really keep up that well. And one guy's fallen so far behind. I don't know who it is, but... Rip. Took that quite beautifully. Just keeping an eye on them. This would have been a decent car for the Thousand Miles series, but... Eh, 
It's a 71, not a 70, so can't use it. Nice. A little bit loose right there, and really loose right here, but at least I kept it on the tarmac. Also, he passed me. Shit. Alright, well, so much for no more NOS. <laughs> I don't want to have to redo this race again if I don't have to. And just like that, I'm back in front and still pulling away. The NOS is just cheat mode in this game. Alright, just gonna take this smoothly but not too smooth where he actually passes me again also so much for being smooth christ okay that was very rough shit fuck just fucking slow down before i fly off the track and my rear tires are warmed up and i'm still getting loose Oh, there he goes. I don't know what's up with the AI and the European cars on this game, but shit, they're all just... ...seem to be shit. Not cutting the chicane, because I'm weird like that. And with the help of Nos. There we go. Very easy win. And he lost control again. With fucking Pojo. Citroen D5 is one that fell super far back. So, that's neat. Let's see where the point ranking is now. Oh, okay, I'll just skip it. So, there we go. Stuff. Blah. 10k. Time for race number three. Alright, special stage, route five time. Rolling start, woo. Three laps around special stage. So yeah, I got nothing. I'll use NOS whenever the fuck I feel like it. How about that? Alright, okay, I overcorrected. Damn snap over steer. Alright, Cleo, you can get out of my way now. Seems like the Renault's gonna take over the Pojo this time around. But, I'm just gonna take over both of them. If I can keep it straight, at least. There we go. Let's see if I can take this turn flat out. Yes, I can. And with minimal NOS, I am starting to pull away. Woo. Uh, getting loose. Oh, fuck. Well, damn. That's gonna be a problem. 
At least I recovered going the correct way. I gotta get these front tires warmed up. I'm gonna oversteer the f fuck out of these corners. By oversteer, I mean just turning the steering wheel way too goddamn much. Just to get them warmed up. Like that. Up oh, bonk. Better not hit the wall, though, because if I do that, then it will just make me go flying the opposite direction. From a sudden slowdown, and then all of a sudden I have all the grip in the world. Also, that slowed me down a lot. But I'm not worried about it, because I have cheats. <laughs> uh, fuck. Alright, now I'm just fucking around at this point. I've got to get serious. Don't want to have to do this race all over again. Okay, emulator slowed down a little bit. Threw me off. Fuck. I'm gonna exaggerate my steering again, just to... Uh, keep the tires warmed up. Not keep, but get them warmed up, whatever. Now that the fronts are warmed, I should have better grip. I probably just wasted a lot more time than I would even gain by doing that. Slow down preemptively, and don't get loose again. Okay, saved it. Nice. Bonk the inside wall once again. I keep doing that with that car, with this car for some reason. Eh, uh, fuck. Bam. Bam. So heavy slowdowns right there. Jesus. That was pretty bad. That was my phone. Unless I'll... Uh, RTX voice cut it out. Then, in that case, you wouldn't have heard shit. So, there's the end of only race number three. Fuck. That took a long ass time. So yeah, I pretty much got nothing left to say for the rest of this entire video besides random shenanigans that happened during the race and shit. So yeah, there we go. 10,000 credits and boop. Time for race number four. All right, here we go at Grand Valley Speedway Reverse for three laps. So it's going to be a little bit of a long one as well. So enjoy another round of pure domination. Getting way too loose right there. Hello, cones. Goodbye, cones. Smack. Well, uh... What a start that was. Shit. That's, uh... Little concerning. Because that shit could happen again.
Gotta make my way back to the front of the field as quickly as possible. Before I lose more ground on the Renault. Smash my way into force, force place. Yes. This guy's gonna bonk into me. Yep, called it. Kind of don't like how they made that turn a double apex now. I prefer the GT2 and GT3 version of that section. But whatever, fuck it. At least it tracks here. Unlike my beautiful red red rock, yes, red rock valley. I really hope Red Rock returns in GT7. That'd be so sick. Still getting loose. Can't keep the damn thing straight. This race should have been just two laps, but fuck, we gotta do three laps around this fucking place. No right mirror, gang. Haha. <laughs> Alright, don't fuck up this turn this time, me. That'd be nice. There we go. Hello, Cone. Oh, fuck, I missed that one. Well, oh, yep, looks like he'll get it. If that was the cone. So yeah, I got nothing. Just enjoy the sounds of this thing. Took that quite well. Also, hi, my voice again. For now. Pretty views. Also, looks like quite an expensive bridge for a racetrack. And there we go. Good thing I have a solid lead.
Also, this track is sponsored by BP. BP oil spills. In case you haven't noticed. The fucking signs all over the goddamn place. Can I keep it straight through the yeses this time? No, I cannot. Answer that question very quickly. Also, this is only race number four. Fuck me. Gotta do this shit another time. And I think it's at Monaco. Not certain. There we go. Finally. All seven minutes. So, yeah, that was extremely boring. But whatever. 10,000 credits. Boop. Time for race number five. Finally. And yep, I figured it's at Monaco. Let's just get right into the shit. Three laps around this place. And yeah, uh, got nothing still, so expect a lot more silent gameplay. Well, that was great. Also, wheel hopping. Jesus. Bonk. Yeah, my fucking way. Damn it. I just have the sudden urge to bash one of these guys straight into the wall. And I've chosen my victim. Did not actually mean to do that, but it happened anyways. Thought I was going to be able to pass him, but I actually want to get a clean overtake this time. He's just going to cut me off. Because intelligent AI. Intelligent artificial intelligence, yes. Oh, he's just gonna pass me again, probably. Okay, or I'll do that. Bonk. Two more boring laps around this place. Yay. I don't even care. I'm just going to use it just to finish this race faster. And also do that.
always almost lose it going around that. Pretty much anywhere, really. Keep torturing myself by choosing these kinds of cars. Small rear engine shit. And bonk. This nitrous just adds a huge punch. A huge, tremendous punch. The liberals hate it. Took that beautifully, my god. See if I can take this without losing it again. Seems like the NOS helped it keep or stay planted. And finally, across the line, geez. This is probably one of the most boring series yet throughout this LP. But it has to be done, and at least it's finally over with. So this is probably going to be the last episode I record for the day, because like I mentioned, I record several of these at a time, so... Just to keep things fresh for me, and yeah stuff so uh 35,000 credits for winning the french championship i'm just gonna call it that fuck it and now time for our prize car please be the pojo please be the pojo and a prize for the french championship are you fucking kidding me fuck Fuckity fuck fuck god fucking damn it. Fucking fuck. Because fuck. I wanted the Pojo 205. And I get one of the worst cars in the game. 54. 1954. 15 horsepower. 15. Skinny ass wheels. Ah, uh, fucking kill me. Well, uh, after that huge disappointment, stay tuned for more GT4.